Another day, another issue. This time, it's about the hair strands. An option that is supposed to make the hair look better in Resident Evil 4 Remake, but in the current version of the game I have on PS5, not only it doesn't make it better, but also it makes it worse. By the way, I'm sick and sorry if I sound different today. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison from the PS5 version of the game, and as you can see, when the hair strand is on, it looks flat and worse. I know, everything in video games is flat, but if you look at the normal mode, when the hair strand is off, it has more depth. You can see it looks more realistic and better than the other one. As you already know, the hair strand in some cases can even affect performance and frame rate while playing. And on PS5, it doesn't even help to make the game look better. So it's a must to turn this option off from the menu to get higher hair quality and more FPS in the game. I'm not sure about Xbox or PC since I don't have them. But currently, if you go to the game, try it yourself and pause the game with the help of follow mode, you can zoom on the face and the hair. Take a screenshot and compare it to the other one. See which does look better to you. If you like it, use it. But from the test I made, it just makes the hair look flat and 2D, worse than the normal mode. This is not the first time I see something weird like this in this game. Last time we were trying to test ray tracing in different situations, and there was a light that was invisible when RT mode was on. And it's not the only option you need to change before playing this game. You can check this video next to get the best PS5 settings for Resident Evil 4 like HDR settings, 3D audio and more. And let me know in the comments below which one do you prefer? Do you want to have hair strands on or off? I'll see you in the next video.